First up is one of America's leading contemporary Latin chefs. Chef Aaron Sanchez, everybody. How are you guys doing? Being from Venezuela, I'm very excited about this challenge, but then I realized the pressure's on me. I'm the one who has to cook the best meal, of course, the Latin guy. To show you just what Latin chefs can do with those ingredients in front of you, Claudia and Aaron Sanchez will be cooking alongside all of you tonight. I think the obvious choice is Alejandro. Mm -hmm. Being Venezuelan Latin cuisine is somewhat in his wheelhouse. Yeah. I saw his face light up when Aron walked in. Yes. Alejandro, how are you doing? Yes, sir. So-so. Uh, I've been better. Come on. I mean, Aron Sanchez, Claudia back. This is in your wheelhouse, Venezuelan. I'm working on arepas, which is Stuff. a classic sort Venezuelan. Sort of bread. Exactly. What are you putting in there? I'm filling it three ways. One is what we call in Venezuela domino, which is the black beans and white cheese. Yes. The other one, I'm going to make steak, and I'm going to try to see if I have enough time to make my last one a uh, seafood. Rice, good luck. Thank you. The first dish we'd like to bring forward, this home cook was able to use more than one protein. They stayed really true to themselves, to their heritage, by putting themselves on the plate. Please step forward. Alejandro. Arepas are a staple of our culture. Venezuelans are arepas. So this is my time to shine right now. All right, Alejandro, please describe your dish. So these are pumpkin seed arepas, three ways. One of them is a seafood mix with red snapper and shrimp. The other is black beans and white cheese. And the last one is a mango salsa and skirt steak. So use some of the fish and the shrimp? Yes. In one. Mm, great heat there. What kind of seasoning? I used cilantro, parsley, butter, olive oil, a little bit of garlic. The arepa shell itself has such a great balance of salt and pumpkin seed. I love that you took like the standard everyday fare of Venezuela and you made it your own. Nice job. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, Chef. I think the corn flavor itself, the fact that you were able to toast it, gives that beautiful sweetness and that nuttiness that this kind of masa needs desperately. So I, I appreciate that aspect of it. I think the flavor profile for me is very straightforward. The sofrito, the peppers, the onions, the lime juice, the butter. That helps add much needed moisture to this arepa. I think that was a smart move on your part. You got a home run. Thank you, Chef. Thank you. Good job, Alejandro. Thank you.